Well, it really is a city that loves its football. I'm talking, of course, about Manchester, and it's a real pleasure to be here tonight at Old Trafford. I'm Derek Ray, ready here on the commentary position, and alongside me is the former Arsenal, West Ham and commentary midfielder Stuart Robson. And we've got Premier League action coming right up. It is Manchester United up against Newcastle United. Well, Derek, we can talk about coaches and their methods, but it's now down to the players. Which ones are going to stand out? Who will affect the game? And who will have the greater desire? It should be a cracking game, though. Now he must favour the cross. Wilson. Can he finish? And a goal right off the bat. No wonder they're jumping for joy. Well, here we can see it again. And no wonder the manager is furious. They just have to get tighter here, deal with the danger. Otherwise, that's the outcome. Not good enough defensively. So United restart the game. Disappointed to have conceded. Can they come up with an equaliser? Casemiro and back with Rashford superb block on the back of the ball from the flank Joe Willock and on the ball is Cher Miguel Almiron Longstaff Joe Linton really good block Mount. What can they do from here? Oh, the threat is there. And it's gone behind for the corner. Over it comes. Relatively straightforward to mop up defensively. A very timely interception. Wilson. Could play it in. Long staff. Really important piece of last ditch defending. Looks promising. Mount, making sure it didn't get past him. Callum Wilson. It's with Joe Linton. Well, it's one pass after another. Joe Linton. Wilson. Long staff. High degree of difficulty to hit it on the volley like that, and it was close. Well, his skill level is so high, you're absolutely right. That's a great effort on the volley. It's looking promising. But no damage done, that's the main thing. Bruno Fernandes. On to Rashford. Surely! And it's in! A goal for Manchester United, who find themselves now level. Well, I have to say, he's done really well here. He's in the right place and then a decent finish. That's a good goal.
So, a level contest, 1-1. Callum Wilson. It's with Joe Linton. Top class defending. And Newcastle pushing forward with options available. Can he give them the lead? Well, the keeper performing brilliantly. Well, that's just incredible. He reacted so quickly there. It's a short corner. Long staff. He'll be breathing a sigh of relief. Ball one. Aaron Wan Bisaka. Bruno Fernandes has it. Well, the referee has instructed the fourth official to put two minutes on the board. Bruno Fernandes. Can he finish this? It's gone in! And well, he might celebrate on the back of that. Well, just look at this. He keeps his composure and he almost passes it into the back of the net. That's a very good goal. And there goes the whistle. That closes the book on the first half here at Old Trafford. Second half underway with United looking to build upon a largely positive first half showing. Well, that's really strong play to keep hold of the ball. And with that, the attack fizzles out. That's useful play, but it fizzles out thanks to that piece of defending. This man will get most of the plaudits for his contribution up to this point, Stuart. Well, Derek, after a slow start where he was tightly marked, he got better and better as the first half went on, and he got his reward with that goal. I'm looking forward to his second half display. Joe Willock. Anthony. Using all his defensive acumen to cut it out. Callum Wilson. It's with Joe Linton. Almiron. Still behind, but the pressure mounting and using his strength to shield the ball. Oh, could be! And it's in! All square again! What a match this is turning out to be! Well, it's great awareness of space in the box, and then he shows a lot of composure with the finish. That's a clever goal. has been quite the roller coaster ride. This is a message for Alex O'Neill. Alex O'Neill, can you Marcus Rashford? Clean team. challenge. Almiron. Trippier. And on the ball is Cher. Trippier now. Just looking for the right moment for that final pass. Needs an accurate cross. 
And that came off the defender, so it'll be a corner. Coming off the pitch, number 28, Joseph Willock. To be replaced by number 10, Alan San Maximo. Now sending it in, and he clears the danger. Wilson. And into the last 20 minutes. Newcastle moving the ball forward. What can they do from here? Sam Axima. Well, far from the ideal pass. Jaden Sancho. Sam Axima. Sam Axima. Wilson, Joao Linton, looking for the angle. Now well, just the tackle that was needed. Well, the United fans are certainly playing their part here. Just listen to this noise, but can they get a winner now? It's going to be United's free kick. Substitution for Manchester United. Coming off the pitch, number 26, Mason Mount. To be replaced by number 14, Christian Eriksen. Just 10 minutes remaining here. Well, the perfect tackle, really. And now a throw in. Ericsson. Well, real difficulty keeping the ball. Individual brilliance. Trippier. Only five minutes left for play, and tension galore with the teams locked together. Almiron, can they forge ahead? Yes is the answer, and that could be oh so important. Well, here it is again, and credit to the goal scorer, but you have to ask questions of the keeper. He's got to have that near post cover for me. No wonder he's frustrated with himself. Well, a dramatic moment near the end, and that might well be the decider. Anthony. Time is against Manchester United, but it's not over for them. Well, adding up all the stoppages, we will have three extra minutes. Well, these United fans can sense an equaliser here, but can the players respond? And there's the final whistle. The grim news from the Manchester United point of view is that United haven't picked up anything from this game. Well, I thought it was a really intense game. Lots of quality, lots of good individual displays. In the end, though, they won't be happy with the defeat, nor the manner of it, conceding so late on. But it just seems that this game, he's been a step ahead of his opponents in every way, Stuart. Well, he gave that back line a torrid time, didn't he? He was far too 